Here we will see default constructor in python. Python will provide a default constructor if no constructor is defined. It adds a default constructor when we do not include the constructor in the class or forgot to declare it. When no constructor is defined, Python inserts a default constructor into your code, which is known as default constructor. It does not perform any task, but initializes the object. It is an empty constructor without a body. The default constructor is not present in the source.py file. It is inserted into the code during compilation if it does not exist. If you implement your constructor, then the default constructor will not be added. For example, here class employees defined with function display and self. Inside this function will print inside display. So when we create object of our class employee and we'll call the method emp.display, it will display the output inside the display. Here we will write a python program to explain default constructor. So first we will open the ideally. Then we will add new file and we will define class employee. Here I will declare one variable message in which I will store the information as employee information. Then I will define one method display with self keyword. And here I will print the variable message. So print self dot message. Then outside the class, we will create object of our class e1. So e1 equal to employee. And we call the method display from that class. So e1 dot display. Then we will save it as default constructor and we will execute it it will display the message employee information here we have not defined the constructor but when we create object of the class python generates the default constructor to initialize the variable 